The last phase of the turning point experience has to do with how the resistance is able to symbolically strike a blow of victory that hopefully will inspire other people to continue to fight to keep liberty alive. New York's a big city and there's a lot to learn in that, in that area. There's a, a, a subway tunnel that might lead to a rooftop that takes you behind the scenes of where all their snipers are so you can take out all their snipers and clear a path for people to move on to get on a train to leave the city. Why you go to Washington is because you're told that there's a resistance down there and that they're, they're banding together and they're gonna join up as one major force to push back the Germans. When you're in Washington, you realize that the Germans are totally onto your game. You lose the first fight in Washington. All your safe houses get compromised. The next step is finding the puppet president that they put in power. And we're going to tell him, you're not doing this. And if he doesn't listen, we're going to kill him, and we're going to blow up the White House, and we're going to move on. Because that puts out a big message to the Nazis. If you can occupy our land, but you're not going to occupy us and what we believe in.